this week's issue, we celebrate the best in summer beauty products with our Grazia Summer Beauty Awards. Um, these are our top picks from the awards. Now Liz, we know this is your favourite deal nail glow, but we just thought it was the ultimate holiday yeah. nail polish. You don't have to worry about it chipping because it's it's quite a light um, coverage, but it's yeah. also very shiny and gel-like. Yeah, it is like having a kind of gel manicure, but without the colour, isn't it? And it, you know in how your nails are kind of two weeks after a holiday, your skin looks brown and they look pinker and healthier. That kind of essentially does mm. that in one mm. coat, which is why I just think it's it's just the ultimate holiday nail. Definitely, and it's quite a good alternative to all the bright colours that we've seen. So if you're, if you're not really into that sort of thing, yeah. like finally there's something that you might want to yeah. give a go. Yeah, and two coats of that does give you quite an intense pink, so mm. it's quite nice that you can kind of like turn it up or turn it down. Mm. And then this one, Best Multitasking Body SPF. And this is the Pisbu in Wet Skin. This is again, first of its kind in yeah. that you can apply it directly to you. Exactly wet skin so if you've been in the pool or if you've been in the sea. You don't have to rub it in, wait for yourself to dry. Exactly, so this is like the latest development in sun care. I also like the fact that it gives you that kind of wet look skin as well so it's quite flattering, quite slimming and just quite sort of a great beach product to have isn't it? You could probably use it in your hair as well I think. Yeah definitely, it's a multitasker. Have a look at this one, this was the Erin Beach Cream for Hair and Body. This um, is our beach body hero wasn't yeah. it? It's a kind of the product that you need to take to the beach with you. So on the beach, it will kind of give you a more glamorous look. After the beach, it will kind of just take you from kind of beach to bar, mm -hmm. just like a real all round like beach hero, I suppose. Yeah, it's just like it's got a slight tint to it. So it yeah. gives you that really gorgeous golden tone to an already developed tan. Yeah. Um, so we, we, and you can also put it in your hair. Yes, yeah, so you can kind of really smooth love. it through, put it in your hair, put it down your shins. Just kind of even on your cheeks maybe, mm. mix it in with your suntan cream. Now this is the Clarins lipstick that won our Holiday Lipstick Hero in Crystal Rose. And it's just, just a really lovely looking product and it's also a great product with a tan. So it acts as a balm, acts as a lipstick. Yeah, on your eyelids. On your eyelids. Yeah, yeah. I, I think you don't really want a heavy lipstick in summer either, do you? No. You kind of want something that can just kind of slick on without looking on mm -hmm. the beach or you know, on the plane, wherever you are, and just kind of freshen your face up and boost a tan. Definitely, and it's a shade that would work for most skin tones as well. Yeah, so we of, thought that was yeah. a stand-up product we did when it came to judging that. So this is the Garnier Amber Solaire BB Cream that won the yeah. best facial SPF for various reasons, really. I guess it's got great protection, but it's also going to give you a bit of coverage as well. So yeah. if you're a bit nervous about going out without Any anything on, then this is like your perfect holiday hero. Yeah, because it can feel quite kind of clammy, can't it? Like layering up if you want to put like a suntan cream on first and then you put like a tinted mm, moisturiser on. It's too much. So kind of that's all you need. And it's such a good, like is it SPF 50, it's such a good level of coverage and sort of protection that yeah. I don't think you need anything else with you. Exactly, yeah. The product that won the most natural bronzer was the By Terry Hyaluronic Summer. The fact that it's a matte finish as well, I think really works for how bronzing is kind of going at the exactly. moment. Exactly. Yeah. Well, they always kind of come up with the best products in summer, don't they? They kind of always come into their own. Um, and I think the fact that this is kind of a matte bronzing veil, mm. so you just kind of apply it and then you get that glow without the actual build-up of using a powder. Exactly. But the fact that it's got the hydrolonic acid in to plump wrinkles and kind of fill the skin means that it's almost like an anti-aging thing as well, isn't exactly. it? Exactly. And you can either add it to you a foundation yeah. or you can just wear it alone or you can just sort of touch up in the areas that the sun would catch naturally. So yeah. it's kind of... You, the only bronzer you'll need really. This is our holiday hair saviour and it's the Orbe Gold Lust Nourishing Lovely Hair Oil. Lust. Not only yeah. does it look fabulous, it, does. it really does do what it says. And you're an oil fanatic, aren't yeah. you? Particularly on holiday. Because if you want to dry your hair naturally, you can just put it straight into the hair and then it'll kind of give it like a hydrating base. Mm -hmm. um, and then if you want to slick your hair back on the beach to look chic, which is very yeah. fashionable this season, again, you can mix that with some cream maybe. Um, and then just, it's kind of the one-stop product really, isn't it, yeah. for summer, which means you don't have to take everything else with you. Exactly. It's like, almost like the dry shampoo of t summer 2013. Yeah. Embrace the wet look. Yeah. This, this is, is amazing. Amazing, yeah. to look at. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's the Givenchy um, Noir Couture Waterproof Mascara. But the thing I like most about this is that it's sort of, it is waterproof, but it doesn't feel like it's waterproof when you wear it. Mm. So it's not stiff and it doesn't kind of cake your lashes and you also, still feel quite fluttery, don't you? Exactly, and I think in the past, waterproof mascaras 
compromised on the um, in the formula and you know what it sort of promised you know if you like long lashes if you like curled lashes you could never really yeah, get that from a waterproof sort of mascara curl them properly did they that kind of felt like it was just very heavy straight. so plumpy very fine or sort of uncurled but that sort of but this gives does it you all. 60s lashes as well which is also brilliant the fragrance for summer for us has to be the Marni signature scent. Which is kind of their first fragrance launch, I think, isn't it, as well? Yeah, it's been a huge hit. I think in summer you can fall into all those like fragrance traps, can't you? Smelling too citrusy or too you know, sweet. Too sweet, and you mm. just kind of go for a summer scent. And I think actually what you want is a scent that kind of you can wear all year round that will remind you of a holiday or that mm -hmm. will remind you of the summer. So it's always quite a nice idea to take a new perfume away with you because then you always have that, that kind of memory Definitely. throughout the year. And this is summery, but in a typically kind of it's very way. chic, yeah. Yeah, it's quite yeah. woody, but it has some nice rose notes in, but it has it's quite sort of spicy too, so it's got pink peppercorn mm. in, I think, which mm. gives it like a kick. So that's it, that's all the Grazia Beauty Summer Award winners. Let us know what you think by commenting below, and don't forget to subscribe to Fashtag. And today we're going to talk you through the best that made the cut. Well, that was rubbish. The oh, best so. that made the cut? Yeah. No, I'll say it again, so. <laughs> For your chance to win one of five sets of our Grazia Summer Beauty Award winners, go to www.graziadaily.co.uk and good luck.